Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Squid Guide showing you how you can complete the time trial from January 21st until January 27th. Starting off with the RC time trial, as always, you're going to need an RC Bandito for this one in order to be able to do this, but you're going to also need $1.5 million if you don't already have one, and also an Arena War Garage. So, if that's worth it, I'm gonna leave it up to you. The time trial itself isn't too difficult at all, primarily because it's pretty straightforward and you're primarily just making circles, really. One of the main issues you'll have with this one is primarily going to be the slight bumps in there. So the main thing you really want to do is follow the route that I'm personally taking. And essentially, whenever you see you're about to go over a bump or something that can even be a slight bump, definitely try to let go of the acceleration so you don't hit anything and can make sure you go through everything as smoothly as possible. This time trial really focuses on making sure that you keep your speed in check because if you try to go too fast you're going to be flying all over the place you shouldn't have to worry too much about time in this one because you have about 10 to 15 seconds to spare so if you need to go a little bit slower and you really want to take your time you should be okay all you really have to do is just avoid crashes and you should be fine Moving on to the regular time trial, which is the parking lot in LSIA all the way on the roof. So, you know, for completion's sake, I'll show you how to get there. Okay, not like that. Rewind! What you need to do is basically make your way to the rooftop first in order to even be able to start this one. The downside of this one is that if you want to restart it, you will start outside of the parking lot, which means that every time you restart it, you're gonna have to make your way all the way back up to the parking lot. But of course, you could also decide to use the stunt jump in front of the parking garage too, if you wanna speed up the process. For the time trial itself, starting out, you want to make sure that you land on your back wheel of your Baddy 801. Because as always, we're going to be using a Baddy 801 for this one. This is arguably one of the cheapest and the best ways of doing this. If you have a little bit of trouble with your bike, you could also decide to start using a car too. In this corner we just passed, we want to make sure that we lean forward a little bit. And as we're making our way to the main road again, and we're going on the pavement on the sidewalk, you want to make sure that you don't do any leaning forward or wheel. If you do so, your bike will start having some bad times with, for some reason, taking on the flight that you don't want it to do. In the main road going forward, you want to make sure that you stick to the middle of the road as much as you can. Traffic is, as always, very unpredictable, so try to look ahead of you to see what is coming. If you see a car coming from the right, make sure to go a little bit to the left, and obviously, vice versa, the same thing. The time trial itself has a lot of straight lines, so obviously, wheeling is going to be of the essence. Again, traffic is going to be your main priority, but if you're paying attention to the route that I'm taking and just dodging the traffic, the way I am and most of the time on that side of the road that I tend to stay at you shouldn't have to worry too much of course it is most likely going to happen once or twice as you get bounced off the bike maybe if you're quick enough you might be able to make it at the finish line still because I personally did it with about 10 seconds to spare but it's going to be entirely up to your own skill if you're able to do that with all that said and with all that done though, that was it for this one. Thank you so very much for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed, subscribe for more. And if you really like what you saw, consider becoming a member like Chloe, Ripstakes and Dr. Strange Love. Join them by clicking the join button down below. Thank you again for watching and I'll see you all later.